Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to set up a Kafka dev environment within 5 minutes. So here we go. Okay, so here's what I want you to do is open up Google, type in Apache Kafka. And then you see a few buttons and go to quick start. And on the quick start page there's the download button. Use the first link. Then it downloads. Boom, already there. Then what you do is you unzip it. Then you open up a terminal. You open up multiple types. Then go to downloads and Kafka. Then check the quick start page. Okay, so fir the first thing you need to do is start Zookeeper. Then start up Kafka. All right, you need to create a test topic. So here is the test topic. We create that here. Paste. Bam. Okay, I've done this before. So it says the topic already exists. And now you can start a producer and a consumer. Start that here. Paste. This is the producer now. And start a consumer for that topic. Take this one. Okay. Boom, boom, and then it's done. This window here, this is the producer, and this window here is the consumer. And when I type in here, I'm sending a message, I'm typing it in here. Let's get a bit closer. I'm going to insert here a text. Test message number, number one, and this message when I send it, it's going to appear on the right side. So let's see it here. Boom, it's already there. And this is basically, I can send messages here. Whatever I'm, I'm sending, I'm sending it straight onto the consumer. Okay guys, so this is basically it. You now have a running Kafka uh, dev environment with a terminal consumer and a terminal producer and you can go from there. The next step will be then to replace the producer with a Java tool that is basically uh, then mimicking what a user front end would do. And then the next step will be to change the consumer to Spark so that when the Java software is producing strings, Spark will automatically analyze that. If you like this one, leave a like and hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed and then we'll meet each other in the next one.